I know exactly why y'all motherfuckers is here today. Cause y'all dogs is skinny as shit. It's storm though. I'm gonna put her down, her ass is heaven. No, we back here with another video. No love kennels, you feel me? All right, so today, I'm gonna be showing y'all what I feed my exotic micro booties for, you know, thickness, you know, that look. I always get a lot of DMs, a lot of questions on what I feed my dogs because of the way that they look, you know what I'm saying? Now, I ain't gonna say what I feed my dog is gonna work for your dog, but they work for my dog, so that's all that matters. But first things first, before you get to anything else, you gotta find a good kibble for your dog and for your cat. Me, I use ProPlan. I use ProPlan because it's good for your dog's coat and their digestive system. You know, earlier, uh, back when, you know, brother had a couple issues with his coat and his skin was very sensitive and this shit saved me. Boom, you need your meat. Your motherfucking meat. You need this. You can use chicken if you prefer chicken, but me, I prefer ground beef. Boom. Gotta get you done. You're done. See, this shit real simple. See, everybody always DMing me, asking me what I feed my dog, how your dog so big. Bro, I don't do nothing spectacular. Kill Pro Plan and me dying. That's it. You got a skimpy ass dog, throw some motherfucking rice in there. But me, I ain't got to use this shit. So. I feed my dogs two times a day. You know, so a lot of people only feed their dogs once. I don't know. Maybe that might be some broke ass problems. I don't know. <laughs> so, let's get straight into it. Shit, I feed my dogs two times a day. Not once, twice. You know, a lot of different breeders do stuff different than they count. A lot of people believe in feeding their dogs once. Me, I believe. Feeding my dogs twice. So like I said, I'm gonna touch on it again. A lot of breeders, you know, use raw, you know, meat to feed their dogs. Me, I don't do no raw diet. I do, you know, cook meat for my dogs, you know. And if you are doing a raw diet for your dog, make sure that you're deworming your dog very often. But I'm gonna, you know, jump into telling y'all, you know, a little bit about me and why I started my camp over here at Nova Kennels. Really, man, the camp being started about two, three years ago. I just had some bullshit ass dogs. I had to be real with myself. You know, I had to get deep into my pockets, man, and spend some money. I mean, that's all it is, man. One successful litter can make you or break you. So you gotta be real with yourself, man. I had spent a lot of money on bullshit ass dogs, getting free dogs, swearing up and down. These are some bullies. These are no papers, no none of that shit. Look, man. Just take out the time, do your shit right, get your papers, you know, just spend, you know, a nice lump sum of money on a good dog, and you're gonna be straight. All that, trying to act like you got papers and trying to act like you got something special, knowing you got a pit bull, it's cool, but just know what you're doing. You know, I've been breeding dogs my whole life. Honest to God, like, you know, my dad had his own camp. We had pit bulls, but shit, it was still a camp. And yeah, um, so you know, RIP to my pops, you feel me? And this is probably my main reason why I do this shit, you know, and my bro too, my bro Kev, you feel me? It's where that no love, that no love come in at, that no love kennels, you feel me? This is for them. So all I do, I put my all into this shit now, you know what I'm saying? And I'm gonna make this shit boom for them, you feel me? Because they living through me. Make sure we get Delera right, because Delera has to eat a lot. His ass is thin. Having these dogs is a lot, man. Having these dogs is a lot. A lot of time, a lot of money, a lot of effort. And man, I'm just going to just tell y'all straight up. If you ain't got the bread, man, to do it, man, you do not need to hop up in this shit. Straight up. Wait till you have your money. Wait till you got the resources, man, to really, you know, boost your camp, man. Because this shit is not easy, brother. Don't let this, don't let people fool you and tell you, oh, man, just get you a dog. And, Bro, it's way deeper than that shit, I promise to God. So boom, now that I added, you know, the kibble, you know, sometimes I do an egg, sometimes I don't. Today, I'm not gonna do an egg. I also use a common egg 
for my dogs. My dogs are very, very hyper, very energetic, because I take them out a lot. We spend a lot of time with them, they get a lot of love. So, boom. But the dogs are very hyper. They need some calming down, they need some motherfucking straightening. Yeah. Get that common egg. You can find us at Tractor Supply. Then I got the allergies that I use from NutriVet. Boom. This is for like when your dog is outside in the cold a lot. You know, it's chewable, it's good for their skin, good for their digestive system, good for their coat. I'm very, very big on having healthy dogs. Over here at No Love Kennels, we are not doing any of that bullshit ass breeding. We're not feeding our dogs bullshit. We're not doing bullshit ass breedings. Everything is legit and it's gonna be legit. Straight up. Say hey, man, like I said before though, man, look, check this out. If your dog is motherfucking skinny, Man, you need some motherfucking rice, man. Go ahead and get you some rice, get you some meat, man, and just feed your dogs right, meats, and kibble. You know, I had this at first, but I didn't need this shit because, I mean, naturally, my dogs just got hella big. I mean, really, it don't matter what you feed your dogs, man. This shit got to do with genetics. You want a bully? You want your dog to look really, really nice? Then fucking buy a fucking bully. Stop being cheap. Like every bully breeder that has been, me including myself, and go get you a nice eight, nine thousand dollar dog. Your dogs ain't cheap, but hey, invest into yourself, straight up. We're gonna put another coat, a dye on there. Bam, and here at No Love Kennels, that's how we feed our bullies. If you want to, you can use gold milk. Gold milk, gold milk is really good. We use gold milk over here, but we substitute it. All right, so now that the food is ready, now we're gonna put that common egg in there. One tablet. I mean, as bigger as big as your dog is, you know, you can give them more. I mean, really, I could give them two, but I only give them one. And then here's the, the allergies, boom, one-on-one. -on -one. The allergies and the common egg. So now, let's get to feeding the bullies. Boom, so I showed y'all when I feed my dogs over here at motherfucking No Love Kennels. All right, I hope this video was very, very helpful, you know, to you guys in y'all camps, you know. May y'all like, may y'all comment, y'all let me know what y'all feed y'all dogs, what methods y'all use, you know what I'm saying? Y'all make sure y'all go tap in with the IG. We're gonna drop the link right there. Y'all stay tuned, you know, this is just the start.